Welcome back to my Let's Play for Something Something Ninja RPG. I suppose it's been a long time, but I was finally able to get back out of there without dying. Actually, I didn't have too much trouble with that, but still. I ran through the forest of death like an idiot and basically had to flee from every enemy I came across. Managed to pull out a win, but definitely wasn't my smartest move ever. <sighs> Do I have any more Thunder Dads on hand right now? Eh, uh, whatever. I can afford to hit him with a little water power, I guess. It's not like they're doing so much damage, I'm gonna really cry about it. But since we had to clear the mess here in order to advance over there, I forgot to double back. Plus, I can't return to where I was anyway, because there's a gale of wind stopping me now. It's like, isn't there some forest stuff here? And like, I don't know, apparently I'm not allowed to continue my investigation in that area. I don't know if that's going to be important or not. Okay. How many bloody slimes are in this place? It's like Slime City. And I've been to Ponyland before, man. Yes, and I tell you, Iris, too, the ponies have their own country, basically. It's protected by the PLF, the Pony Liberation Front. Yeah, I've heard some terrible stories about the PLF. That they're basically terrorists, but... Hey, when you're a pony, you know, a slime ball, you gotta do what you gotta do in order to keep your country free, man. That means doing some less than legal actions, well, I can't blame them. Let's face it, everyone just crushes slimes left, right, and center. They get no respect. They're the butt end of every joke in the monster world. Except in that one game. Um, this is a game. It was an entry in the 2015 Indie Game Maker Contest. It was about a slime becoming super powerful by stealing uh, panties belonging to a succubus. Yeah, it was a weird game. What can I say? I've played some weird stuff over the years, man. Okay. I'm gonna wish I'd brought more magic potions at this rate. Ah, a support technician, huh? Well, don't look too powerful. A hundred? I take it back, they're stronger than I thought. Okay, got him. Of course, that next attack's gonna get wasted. I hate that effect, man. I wish if they had to do a secondary attack, it'd go on to the next target. And if they couldn't do that, you know, stop after the first attack killed them. Because wasting all that time over time, you know, with attacks going nowhere is really getting on my nerves. It just feels so wasteful and it irritates me, okay? So we got fire slimes, huh? Well, I guess that means I'll feel happier about my current equip setup somewhat on um, Autumn. Or not. Uh, apparently, you know, the electric attacks really don't work on these guys. And the earthen blade doesn't work too well from Lisa. Uh, trade offs. And the fact these guys are more likely to cast magic is not helping my mood either. Can we please take this guy out? <sighs> but not for he gets his next attack in. Gosh darn it. And the fact his fire attacks are on the entire group really sucks. Gotcha. So I can grind on them for um, somewhat useful healing items. Let's see, magic water again. Okay, let's see, how do I get to that room? Um, item. Well, this is gonna be really inconsistent. I don't expect much on the fire guy, but 
expect there, man. Oh, he's stunned? Sweet. Well, at least we can sure we hit there. There is that. Patient strike. Well, that was very precise. Yeah, it is. Got that right. <sighs> Great. You know, just can we just go? I want to try and get past this barrier. Keyword on try. I may not be able to. Um, let's see. Why do I have to use an active skill for that? Whatever, strike through. Skull Basher! I just gave you an STD. Take that. Okay. Darn it. These small guys really don't respond that much to attacks, I guess. At least of certain elements. I guess it makes sense. They are slimes, after all. It makes sense they'd be more immune to attacks like that. But the constant debuffs are annoying. I suppose I could technically switch over to Freeze Blast, but... I prefer to save that for later, you know? Please do something. Oh, come on. I only hauled him out for one turn. And it doesn't even matter. He already got his ability off. That felt like a waste. If only I could gain TP from attacks that did no damage, man. That would be convenient. Uh, Justice Fireball, I guess. Come on! Justice Fireball! Huh. He did, huh? An ID card, gotcha. Okay. So they should be all renewed for two more years. <laughs> I guess. Gotcha, gotcha. So that was useless. Oh, come on. Can't I just get away for a little bit? Ugh. I don't even feel like we're making progress at the moment. Okay, I guess I'll try going downstairs, maybe. Maybe I can interact with this object. I don't know. Oh, it's a save station? Well, great. That's not what I was looking for. Oh, H2O, huh? Too bad I'm not the water boy. Then I might actually care. Great, it's a bat. They're the bane of my existence, man. Great. My opening move did nothing. That's never a good sign.
I'll try again, but it might be because it's a aerial enemy. I can't touch it with um, Earth powers, maybe. It makes sense, I suppose. Uh, nothing much there. Try Poison, Skull Basher. If I can lock him up for a few turns, it'd be nice. Huh, quite the durable little knight. I mean, it wasn't gonna save him, but hey. At least he was noticed. If only just. You do, huh? Can you tell me where it's from? Uh, there's the second floor staircase, because now we're back on the first floor. Okay. Put the hurt on this guy, I suppose. After all, my efforts on the bat last time didn't go anywhere. Ouch. Freeze blast, I guess. Boom. Man, that poison stuff never works. 50-50 never actually works in my favor at all. Sucks, man. Well, I don't want to waste any more energy here. I didn't bring a ton of MP recovery after all, as we've noticed repeatedly. Let's see, what on earth was that? Oh, suits and lubes. Gotcha. Uh, I ain't got time for jokes like that right now. Let's see. Yeah, it really is. I feel bad for you, I really do, but... I don't want to run around killing all these things. So don't expect me to be too sympathetic. Especially considering, you know, a lot of these slimes are faster than Lisa, which just blows. I had to sacrifice quite a bit of agility for that weapon. Okay. Let's pull back for now. Ah, jeez. And why on earth is there a cut-off series of black boxes on the bottom? It makes you look like there's nowhere to go, man. The dark spaces, they're just an illusion meant to deceive you. Ugh. Okay. Oh, I know why. It's because... It's not going to fill the whole screen with the way I got set up. Gosh darn it. Um, try and hold off on that. Keyword try, I don't know if I'll be able to succeed. Justice Fireball! After all, these guys are really annoying. Mostly because they don't know when to die. Smogify, huh? Well, this just blows. Justice Fireball! I know, I, sh I should stop doing that, but... I don't know, there's just something fun about saying it that way. Okay, once more. Ugh. 
think I don't need too much more power to finish this. Okay, let's do this. With the fireball of justice. It's quite the spicy meatball. A supervisor, huh? Where do I find a supervisor? And don't tell me I'm gonna have to head back to World's End for that. Because that would just be annoying. I ain't got the patience for you right now. Oh, there's a chest over there. Maybe it's got an item I can steal. Oh, there's gotta be something over there. If you're gonna set up a booby trap, as minor as it is, there's gotta be something worthwhile in that chest. Or there better be. <sighs> Man, Lisa. Being slowed down by that earthen sword is really making you less useful. I mean, you're good for the finishing blow, but since I take so much damage waiting for it to come, it's getting really annoying. Probably just do a Kirk speech. Oh, a full potion? That's not what I'm looking for. Well, maybe I'll drop one of those, um, weapons again, you know? Gosh darn, is this game too full of battles for its own good? Ugh. It's gonna take me forever to find, um, one of my previous um, submissions on Archer.net for this. It's gonna be buried by now. It's been months since I last did this. <sighs> I don't care where you stashed your money. Unless it's like 20,000 grand or something, it's not meaningful to me. I suppose they are. I got a microchip, eh? Why is there such a weird drop on down there anyway? It makes like no sense. Ugh. Okay. Two thousand three hundred forty five, gotcha. <sighs> Why is this thing always gotta have such weird mapping? Like you're looking for secrets all the bloody time. Gotcha. And where am I supposed to find a former employee at? I hate this game. Like, oh, there's a place, there's a place, gotta go to this place. Like, why do you have to constantly stretch out every single one of these quests with constant finds me's? It makes it hard to come back to this game when you re-pick it up, because you're not going to remember where all the stuff's at. This is not a game you can take a break from for months at a time and not be punished for it. And gosh darn, does that sound effect get annoying. Please take that away. Seriously, it's like every single one of them sets off the sound effect, so it's super loud and super scratchy. And it just gets on my nerves. Ugh. 
<sighs> well, nice. I can't even go that way anymore. Let's, let's just run. Okay. Gotcha. Well, whatever. Come on! Just let me leave! Ugh. This game wasn't so bad, it wouldn't drive me so nuts, but it's every couple steps. Useless. I just want to go home to the inn. Ugh. Gosh darn you guys persistent. Ugh. Like, they're so freaking persistent, it's freaking annoying. Like, get off my back. Seriously. I love how you can get more HP back than what you actually have to spend for the attack in the first place. That's impressive. In the wrong sort of way. Ah, oh, great. I keep bringing down magic. Oh, poison actually got off for a change. On an element. So it's not even an enemy that has a real form. It's literally just lightning. So maybe able to infect it in the first place makes no sense. Ugh. Guess we have to go check out World's End again, maybe, and see if there's a former employee there. Of course, that means finding my way back there again. Ugh. Well, that does it for this episode. Hopefully I can find something useful next time. Though for all I know, I may have just found a bug that completely makes the game unbeatable. Ugh. If so, I guess I can laugh at it. Till next time then. See ya.